In 2018, the Game Awards teamed up with Facebook Gaming to honor global gaming citizens, people from all areas of gaming who use the power of games to create a positive influence. Tonight, I'm joined by one of the global gaming citizens we met last year who has a new project to show us. Please welcome Luol Mayan. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Yeah. Yo. So, Luol, what have you been working on? Yeah, for sure. You know, as someone from uh, Africa and also as a refugee, I want to thank everybody that has been supporting me to come up with a game today. Facebook Gaming, Eisenberg, and Luol Deng. I've been working on a game that actually put a player in the shoes of a refugee. It's a game that actually talk about journey and helping people to understand the empathy. And this is something that video game can be able to do around the world. We can be able to change the world and help people around the world and see what, whatever they're going through, through playing video game. So it's a game really that put a player in the shoes of refugees and breaching the reality wall and, the, and what is actually happening on the ground. So I'm really so excited about the project. Yeah. Incredible. Well, let's Thank take you. a look. Yeah, sure. Thank you. I create Salam because games are very powerful to, to create empathy and to help people understand the journey of a refugee. Growing up in a refugee camp, my mother spent three years looking for $300 to buy a computer. And then I taught myself how to create a video game. My mission in Craig Salam is to let the world know what it's like to be a refugee. When you buy medicine and food in the game, it goes to real refugees, refugees like me. Together, we can take small steps to make a big difference.